and while we were away, a bunch of stuff got announced. Oh yes. yes. While we were out, while we were drinking, we were in the middle of emo night, and Ben starts screaming at me from across the room that there's a OCG list, there's yes. updates, there's fucking shit. I was devastated. So I we shit we were at and we were at emo night, and the OCG ban list drops, and my favorite card is banned. Yeah, so uh, do we just... My discuss... favourite card was unbanned. <laughs> yeah, so let's discuss it now. So, uh, yeah, we have a new OCG uh, forbidden list uh, that's effective as of my birthday. That's called a segue. Happy birthday to me. Um, so, forbidden, we have Halka Fibrax. Oh, no. Vanity's Emptiness. Rest in peace. And Totally Awesome. Man Goodbye. said a moment of silence OCG ban list effective on his birthday like it's not effective on his birthday every year. <laughs> yeah. They literally drop pay, one they drop on July first every yeah. year. Okay, so every I don't year. play their format. I don't pay attention to what happens in a film for the most part. I take a cursory glance, I'm like, oh, okay. The people that are um, sitting there like why can't we play OCG? Shut up. So I'm quite mad I'm quite mad by this. Just a totally awesome hit. How can Firebrax can fucking die? Vanity's emptiness shouldn't have been in the game. It yep. got really toxic <laughs> apparently in the OCG with some interactions that you can do where your opponent would activate vanities and you'd chain cross out, sending vanities, and then you play and then they're locked under the vanities on their turn. Um It's in there. That wasn't meant to happen. <laughs> yes. Oh wait. So, when you cross out, is the yes. entire card negated? The, the card gets turned so, off. So, you can send shit to their grave, it won't go. Yeah, it's oh, that's it doesn't so die. Rah. You can out their entire board, leave them on just the vanities, and then when you pass your turn, the vanities <laughs> turns back on. Who goes, I'm here. Yeah, yeah and the only thing that <laughs> can be destroyed... What if I went to sleep, what does. happens? That, what if that dude died, whatever that thing... Oh yeah, be. KP dude. I return. <laughs> um... <laughs> Uh, uh, totally awesome is a weird one. I was almost sure they would just start gunning down things in the archetype. It, I think it's because it puts a negation onto the archetype. Like, Hulk, again, also banned close to the same reason. Hulk also used in do, that deck. Does the deck do anything now? Oh, yeah, it sort of heaps. Like, I don't know. Oh, I guess the monsters have negates. And, yeah, it like, just doesn't. There's like, other things you can do. It's just not, oh, I get to do them, and also I have a negate halfway yeah. through, so you can't do shit after that. Yeah, it's just no. not absurdly free. Okay. I'm keen for it to be absurdly free in the TCG. Maybe not as good, but no, I'm. You see, the thing in the TCG is that we're going to have three toad when we get the deck. They just had one. <laughs> oh, they were only allowed it, it was, one? It was limited. Oh, and now it's gone from guys. I have band. to go check my binders. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I was going through my bulk today, and I like pulled across like any toad thing. I was like Ronan, Gib, Gib, Dupe, yeah, Gib. yeah, just give it all. Um, I just had Max Rarity sitting around all the time, so not anymore. I see you selling it. It's not mine. Oh, oh shit! That's why I yeah. angry reacted because yeah. I saw you <laughs> selling that ulti swaps, and I was yeah. like, "What are you doing?" Well, see, then? I have more than a playset. Ah, oh, King <laughs> Kingen is what he's doing. Um. Yeah, very excited to see what that does here then, because fun. We have other things that have happened. Yes, uh, we've limited, seen limited. We have uh, Eva, which again should have happened a while ago. Uh, Spellbook of Judgment uh, uh, and Branded Opening. Can I have a uh, half a point for my? No, damn. <laughs> it seems a terrible, terrible idea. Nah, it's fine. OCG it's is, is king of bad. bringing stuff back that we think can't come back. Like. What's the worst that can happen? You get jogged. <laughs> yes, that is specifically. Yeah, that the, is the... precisely the problem. No, but you, it's not like a quick jogging. It's not like that jogging's hitting you immediately. Like, look, we we realized with all of these cracked cards coming back, they're not that good because they are slow, and decks at the moment just say no. Yeah. Like, what's what's worst can happen? You go full combo, and your opponent goes, "I activate Skullbook of Judgment," and you go negate. Okay, you're saying that like you're going first all the time. So if you're a, you're a Sky Striker opponent, let's say, goes fucking off, and then at the end they just get a Jargon as well. Well, then they can't take this ball. <laughs> Try Sky Striker cards. Yeah, I know, but DPE also didn't give them that problem. Yeah, but DPE could remove itself from the board. I guess. The Jargon just says no. Jargon says... Mm. But I guess then if you try and remove the Jargon, then everything's on. Yeah, true. You can negate the Jalgen, and, and then, then everything's off. Every everything's off, but you impound the drag the Jalgen, you win. Just open it, idiot. Yeah, just open yeah, just it. Open just open the out. outs. Um, I feel like that really should be the slogan for this game. <laughs> just open it, idiot. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Um, Eva, yeah, that should have happened ages ago. 
I so the weird thing about this ban list, like the Eva hit, I think is the OCG being like, if we hit Splite, what if people play what they're playing on Master Door? <laughs> Thus, they needed to hit Eva. <laughs> That's pretty good. <laughs> That's pretty good, actually. No, it's a hit to agents. Um, and branded opening again. That's just lowering the. It consistency. was a two, right? Yeah, it went to two in yeah. the last list. Yeah, yeah. they've yeah. just moved all that stuff down for fear that it could just get take better. immediately take over. Yeah. yeah, sure. When you check the deck, that's absurdly better than in, over there. All of a sudden, it's good. Yeah. Yep. Uh, then we go on to semi limits. We've got GNX Ali Birdman Ally, yeah. I should say. That's a loop. That uh, yeah, it oh. is. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, just um, <laughs> that level three that like you mill a top card and burn your opponent for the oh, level. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, that with um, Ally Birdman is a loop. Fine, sick, good. This is bullshit. This is bullshit. <laughs> this is fucking garbage. Uh, Flounderies and the Magnificent Map is also a two. Leave him alone. I've never actually read its full name. Uh, I've just been ma- like, ma- oh yeah, ma- full yeah tip. Magnificent Map. Yeah, yeah. It's it's you know. Uh, and brand of fusion, sure. Again, just, just to yeah. bring down consistency, yeah, sure. so that it's not the most overpowered deck. However, I will get on to what is the most overpowered deck in just a minute. Um, we all unlimited. Know it's Jake. Yes, yes, it is. I'm looking very forward. Uh, unlimited. We have right. August Harp Horror. Uh, oh yeah. Harmonizing Magician. Sure. Night Assailant Post Arada makes sense. Thunder Dragon Roar. Um, can I ask a really quick question? No. Is Brag asleep right there? Kinda. Yes. Okay. Don't scream. Okay. <laughs> Lone Fire Blossom. Trishula, Dragon of the Ice Barrier. The Beginning of the End. <laughs> Rageki, Divine Wind of Mist Valley, which is also limited here for uh, reasons I don't fully even, understand. Let me tell you something. That card has been on the ban list since I started playing this game, and I still don't fucking understand <laughs> why. I believe it looped. Mm. It's, a oh, lot of 100%. these cards are just cards that um, I remember Harpies used to play it because it's like oh they do the bounce Yo Senju used to play it, it was. oh of course that's why yeah, I was yeah, like yeah. why is this card limited it's also bad but anyway uh, Soul, Soul, Sword Soul Emergence and Wind Up Carrier Zen Matey let's go Ruby we fucking hit looping cards <laughs> there's a lot of cards that they just it is a lot they were just like <laughs> they go off we gonna loop the amount of it might not matter but the amount of cards you can summon through like as many negates as they've fucking got is I don't know what they'll do with it they might just get a full board of little fucking robot dudes and say we're here now kill us they also have um, a link to you that just has always existed in a world where you don't have Hunter or Zenmady yep and now they have both over there um genuinely like not a lot of hand traps can stop that deck it, you need to open like multiple now Nabiru yeah, that'll do it. Yeah. Oh, no, wait. <laughs> Actually, I'm gonna do it. Because <laughs> you can summon. Oh, no, Nib takes all of it, right? So, Gets like... rid of everybody. Yeah. See. <laughs> That's problematic. Yeah. It's a two there. <laughs> no- nothing can deal with it except for the most prominent hand trap since its release other Big than Ash Blossom. Rock. <laughs> we see robot, rock. we throw rock. <laughs> Um, yeah, so that's all coming into effect really soon. Um, Thunder Dragon Roar is an interesting one because Colossus never left for them. Colossus, Colossus has always a been one. a one. Yeah. Eh. And you're just adding to the consistency of it. Also, I'm yeah. kind of surprised that, like, um, Branded never took the opportunity to just be like, eh, throw a Thunder at the board and make a Colossus as well. Like, I've ne- eh. never seen any list for that. I won't lie to you, but every time I remember Colossus as a card, I go, what the fuck was that? I just every single time I go, nah, should have been printed. Get it away. It wasn't Don't like it. It wasn't atrocious card. Like it like, is it's con- super unfair. <laughs> it's real free. It's it's so free. <laughs> it's free. It's freer than your mum on a Sunday. That is pretty damn free. Freer than the breadsticks, Ben. Freer. You all got breadsticks, what? Breadsticks. The breadsticks are free. Somebody will get it. It's fine. Uh yeah, so Again, like I was saying, it doesn't. No part of this, other than maybe the branded stuff, if you want to argue it, has addressed what was slowly becoming the more popular deck in the OCG, which was Tier Element. What does it do? Partic- Conspiracy uh, theorists. Basically, Light Sworn Cross Shadol. They mill themselves, and then once they mill themselves, they shuffle themselves back into the deck to fusion some. Conspiracy oh, theorists cool. like yeah. Jake will <laughs> try to convince you that Tier Elements was the better deck of the two. It was not. Otherwise, it would have gotten murdered on the ban list. Um, yeah. Splite is better. 
But Two sure, it is. Two Elements has its own little toad. niche there. Splat without Toad? Well, that kind of negates shit all fusion. Yeah. Yeah. Window. <laughs> Window. Also, again, that's another card I keep reading going. Hang on. This is so unfair. Yeah, so to get Just... back on the tier element train for a second, um, they can do that off turn. But why? You're going first, and they're just like, okay, uh, mill, fusion, winder. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sure. Um, the nearest variant actually looks super fun. It's, um, they've got, um, Hang on, you know, can a Shizu. you do it if your opponent says you can only summon level twos? Hence the reason why... Is... They, oh, do it, okay. they do it immediately. Oh, okay. Like, cool. the second you start playing, they're like, mm, winder. <laughs> <laughs> Um, okay. But yeah, um, the newest variant that I've seen is doing f- relatively well in the OCG is the Ishizu, Ishizu Retrain Fairies um, using Exchange of the Spirit, which is like a, a pay a thousand, you both swap your deck with your graveyard. Okay. They mill a heap of shit, and then, and then, then their sh- cards like let you manipulate what's in grave as well. So if they see that you have um, stuff that would be good in deck in the graveyard, they're like, oh, okay, put that back in the deck. And then swap it around. And then flip. I would argue that this is a win more build. Sure. And that's funny. And I'll enjoy seeing it happen once every couple of games. And we'll laugh about it. And then not I'm looking it. really forward to tier elements. They're looking forward to Sply. He probably won't play it. Because busy. Novel summer. Frogs. <laughs> I'm keen for frogs. I won't lie to you. We're only like a month and a half out from Sply. I can't wait for it to get delayed. Do you know? Oh yeah, that's. Do you know the thing? Oh, it's a major set. set. I also, I'm also a month and a half out from being free every Sunday, so I can do it, um, and I'll be just down the road. So Sunday locals. I know it's not Tuesday night locals, but it's close. I work. We move. We move on to Master Duel. No, we frog. Uh, Lots of things have happened on Master Duel of late. Uh, Firstly, we have Uh, any of them birds. No, I sleep. Uh, Uh, yeah, so new packs got added. They didn't really add a lot. They added um, the agent cards. Cool. Uh, they added the punk cards as well. Um, and some Great. other stuff. Um, every... It's not made a whole heap of difference in the meta I've seen on a, there. a lot more punk running around. I mean, yeah, it's kind of a, just a free engine. Because yeah. like, I think Italy is at one still in Master Duel. I don't know, I don't acknowledge those things, I just have DK. Except you don't. I saw you the other day. You don't. You were playing August. Oh. No, that was today. And that was in the event that started today in Master Duel. Ah, yes, yes, yes. We'll get onto that. The one of us tournament. Yes, yes, yes. Um, But yes, uh, that has also been announced. uh, The Highlander format. Um, I started building it and then I ran out of engines that I already own and the prospect of me oh, buying yeah. more engines it, was like mm, mm, it, mm, it cost me a lot I, I yeah. had enough to like <laughs> build a new deck and I was like guess I'm just investing in a bunch of one-offs <laughs> I literally just slapped whatever engines I already had I thought I'd already had enough to put in like a small trickstar engine nope <laughs> so you just went like invoke and yeah, I'm like, I own this deck, put this in. I own yeah. this deck, put this in. I own this deck, put this in. Yeah. Um, which, Seems with four engines, got so me up well. to about 30 cards. And then I was right. like, mm, consistency cards. Uh, one of every danger. Uh, card destruction. Uh, <laughs> the, the, Do you put, trap? put the pots in. Uh, I'm not going to see them. You're not going to see yeah, them. Yeah, but you're so. just filling space at that point. I've finished my build. My build, I went with PKBA. Oh, Orcus. PK's a shout. Oh, I think I've got PK. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. It's like PK, BA, Orcus, shenanigans. Sure. Yeah, look, so that you, makes sense. You go like standard PK, BA combo, and then also Orcus combo on top of this. Basically, my deck is going to end up being any variant that I've ever played with Invoked is going in. Yeah. <laughs> Shadol is there, Mech Knight is there. Um, Orcus hasn't been with Invoked, but Orcus has been with Mech Knight, so that's. Get in. <laughs> there is the problem of Nightmare Mermaid is still banned. <laughs> yes, yes it is. I, I was like, Nightmare Mermaid. Ooh, damn. <laughs> ah, I and also, Geese who's at one. Uh, Harp is still at one. So is everything else. Oh yeah, that's, it's yeah, that's better, how that works. It's a yeah, one-off yeah, yeah. format. I forgot that we were talking about that for a minute. Um, it only yeah. matters if it's at zero. Yeah, pretty much. Also, new oh. battle pass. 
Yes. Uh, so with Shep. So that started today. Uh, so today. the rewards for this, uh, we get the uh, Warrior Digrepher is one of the tokens. But no one cares. Uh, we get. Would you call me? <laughs> we get uh, Mech Knight uh, Crusader Avramax as uh, the background piece that you can have on like your player card. Uh, uh, no one ever sees it. No one ever cares. But most importantly, Shep. at one hundred, you get Scatgot. Shep. Is it just the pink one? I it think seems to be. I saw them post a video of it, and it was just the pink one, which is fine. Man's abandoned us. Yep, because it's not birds. But there, I was promised laundry dragon maid mate. It's coming. He promised this to me like a month ago. The one I good didn't use promise for that monster, you shit. You're I the said man, it was there. You're the man who brings me my master door news. Yes, it's true. Where is my master door content? Where Shep? Where his birds? Where bird? I actually don't know why they're so afraid. I'm to bring fucking. The birds, do you hey? know why? Because they'll be tier zero, and they know it'll be tier zero, and they're fucking cowards. Except they won't. No, they're cowards, Jake. I swear to God, they're they cowards. They won't be tier zero. I'm My video now. says otherwise. <laughs> <laughs> How dare you? But yeah, it is. I should have said Thunder East Tier Zero is my title. That's a way better yeah, title. Your title's clickbaity enough. Ah, <laughs> oh, damn. I really tried, Ben. I tried so hard. Or maybe you should have gone like, what was the title already? Like, Thunder East It was, is just, literally, it was literally just Thunder East in Master Duel question mark. Tier Zero. Tier Zero. Exclamation mark. Gone wrong. Gone sexual. No, birds don't go sexual, huh, Ben? <laughs> They're all the algorithms. Yeah. Um, but yeah, the Fourteen. thing that I'm most happy about with that particular um, Highlander format thing is the ban list that they've implemented. They took out all the bullshit cards, like fucking Vanity's Skill Drain, uh, Draco cards, uh, D effectively DPE. Like, you can still run actual DPE, but you don't have De Fusion Destiny, so you can't just sack a one of and be like, haha. Uh, right. Verte also banned. I still had someone today normal summon a barrier statue set four pass. <laughs> <laughs> that's pretty good well, I also got set four, it's less likely that they're gonna have like solemn judgment solemn judgment solemn warning yeah but there's a bunch of solemn good traps judgment. yeah that's fine play lightning storm also just uh, I'm gonna make a top 10 fonderies cards for you <laughs> I'm just gonna do it fuck it <laughs> don't care number 10 now. <laughs> number bro number <laughs> fucking 49 now. not even 49 bro Snell is worse in the deck than most fonderies cards it's not even the worst Fonderies card. It's one of just the worst cards in the deck. Like, if you... Don't put it in the deck, please. Rise is being reprinted, okay? Don't put it in the deck. I've had three comments so far fucking tell me to put it in the deck. Stop. Not worth. Um, we also have news uh, unrelated to Master Duel. What the fuck is uh, that? It's the next uh, deck building pack, the Amazing Defenders. Jesus uh, so we have Christ, hits on what's all three... <laughs> Fuck so me. we've got three hints at the archetype as well as the artwork. Uh, so the first one is R Ace, which apparently in the OCG is Rescue Ace, uh, a righteous ace monster that bravely stands up to any and all threats. Uh, basically, looks like a Barrel Dragon on crack. Um, it's called Race. Yes, R -Ace. I know what it's defending now. <laughs> race Wars. Race Wars. Um, the next one is called Purely, uh, which is an Xe monster that grows when it receives love. That's a non suck type. Yes, it is. Uh, not as much as the next one. Oh, no! <laughs> that's, a, that's a non suck type. That's a non suck type. Makano. No women, a young maiden that serves Kami in Shinto. Uh, and apparently, it's a uh, ritual monster that advances through Mysterious Dance. So it's bad. Uh, yeah. It's not going to be great. Ritual archetypes inherently are slow. Unless you give all of them a Shadol Fusion ritual card. Hear me out. Hear me out. Hear me out. What if? Three what if? It's kind of bullshit. No, 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 no. What if they just make Sky Striker, but the, instead of you having Ray, it's just a ritual monster? What? You literally print every Sky Striker's card again. Yeah. Except you make it based around a ritual monster. It does say by Mysterious Dance, all the cards could just be different dances. Look, that may well be oh, what this cha -cha ends up being. And the cha-cha <laughs> engage. Cha-cha <laughs> engage. Do your bonus card. Cha-cha. Well, well, no, you'd have to call them different. It'd be, cha -cha -cha. It'd be Meccano. Cha-cha. Cha-cha. Cha-cha-cha. What would, what would be afterburners? Flamingo. <laughs> um, what's the other one? Um, Konami. Hornet drones. Um, oh, that's a waltz. 
Feel free to steal this idea, Arthur C. Konami. <laughs> Don't steal it. Pay us money. No, steal the idea. Print the deck. It's a ritual. You just flip the barrier. <laughs> Honestly, that's the worst people, thing about wait. the current format is like people just want to go in and play their like time thieves and fucking necros and shit. Nope. And everyone's like, nope. Yeah, because they're branded, your deck is fucked. Here's the thing, too. <laughs> people were like so heavy on D Baz is a fucking double card because we have these blue new cards called links and they're not on the fucking card. Mm. And <laughs> like, like we weren't going to get an archetype at some point that didn't fucking revolve around links. Okay, so, so, so here's onwards. the thing. You say this, yes. but you were also on the podcast wearing a tie saying that links are the death of the game. Shut your no, fucking No, but they face. went... Aw- they went they, it, it, uh, yes, and I'm standing by that. It fucking slaughtered the game for like a year. It I slaughtered it. Only for stupid people. Yeah. No, no. Only, that, no you no, gave no, no, us no. the most consistent FDK of all time. What the fuck are you talking about, Jake? No. Yeah, it didn't give us that until like at least a year after they were released. No, that's what I'm that, saying. That, that was period in period of time. February. Yeah. It was fucking close. It, but was, it they, was nine they, months. But they sorted it out. And I think they made a lot of cool cards and a lot of cool decks. And now they've kind of gone away. Like, uh, I think it's fine now. Konami said, here is double helix. And I was like, I like Link Summoning now. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Very nice. I Very went from success. summoning Mrs. Radiant and being like, how the fuck does this work? To be like, you're double helix. Okay, I won. <laughs> what was that voice? <laughs> what? Man said, that's, that's my double helix voice. Here's 17 negates and 14 pops. Have fun. <laughs> oh, you have evenly? I don't care. I popped. Uh, you can't. Uh, you can't no, you don't. You have trigate. <laughs> yeah, but it forced the trigate. And then, and then you got the like, double oh, pop no. and the other fucking negate and the other fucking thing and cherry St- still in a battle phase. <laughs> <laughs> uh, anyway, uh, we you have double the next. You on sleeper, it was fine. The next retrain of structured X has also been uh, leaked a little bit, uh, which is in the OCG called Devil's Gate. Will not be that here. No, because uh, uh, Konami of America it's sucks basically uh, the was Dark World. The old one called Gates of the Dark World. The first one. Yeah, I think so. Damn, they can't even call it that. More gates of the dark world. <laughs> Gadia um, of the dark world. Uh, because Ben has banned me from reading the cards. Good, um, because they're shit. And if yeah, they're, unless the dark they're world, good, they're, they're all right. They're fine. They're not that good though. Uh, one's just a retrain of Greffa. Effectively, um, summons itself back by bouncing one. Yeah. Uh, one is a uh, like uh, soul release that lets you discard a fiend afterwards, and then uh, lets you recur banished. One one's of them is a, a fucking. Bamboozling Gossip Shadow. Uh, yeah, the what? fusion. Yeah, yeah, the fusion. It's um, the Bamboozling Gossip so, Shadow. So, yeah, when your opponent activates a spell trap, uh, I think it's just spell trap. Or a monster effect. Um, just change it to your opponent discards a card being you. Yeah, and then so because it you to discard. Yeah, and then and you all, the dark, your dark all the Dark effects. Worlds get other effects oh, that they're discarded. it's not discard. even Durandal. It's better. Yeah. Yeah, look at that. Just changes... Opponent activates Rota. No, 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 no. I will discard now. <laughs> no, no. You me. have you have ripped one, and also um, floats into one of the big boys. Yeah. Um, and then they yeah. also get a quick play fusion um, that lets them summon a fiend, so potentially splashable in like Despia variants of branded. Um, but then the interesting thing about it is that uh, if you're summoning the Dark World one specifically, it discards the cards as fusion material. So then it triggers them as well. Oh, okay. Oh, well, that's a, that's cool. That's like a nice it, little. It synergizes very well. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's the same as like the rocket one um, lets you destroy the monsters as fusion material, so trigger all your rockets. Um, Send off birthday. Oh. <laughs> um, Where did the snack go? <laughs> <laughs> um, as well as that, in um, I don't know what set this is. D A B L. Uh, we've got oh um, I don't know what that is. We move! So we move on to uh, the next major set after after the one. Uh, we get... Uh, what is that called? I can't remember what that set's called. I'll figure it out. You uh, have literally a rerun because this definitely isn't the second time we've shot this part of the I know this, but I didn't you have forgot, time to look it up! I forgot twice. I didn't forget twice. I've still forgotten the same time. I've never looked it up again. Okay. Anyway. Um, we've got retrains of the Draco Slayers, or new Draco Slayers if you'd prefer. Um, so we've got one that belongs to Ignis, we've got one that belongs to uh, Magic Spectre, and one that belongs to Dynamist. Uh, one searches Donut a field moist. spell for free. One. <laughs> no, but, so, for some reason, every time I hear Dynamist now, I think Donut Moist, because that's what we called them for like a year and a half. 
What do you mean we? Lachlan and myself. Oh, good. Yes, perfect. Report that to the community. <laughs> yeah, I will. Have him, man. Um, yeah, so Majesty is probably... They can't search Drago face off. They should search map. Uh, none of them are that great. A lot of them will be pack filler. Dynamist is um, one card, full combo. Yeah. Technically three cards. Yeah, technically the other, six. The other two cards <laughs> just need to say Dynamist. Yeah. And then Yaguchi. Look, for Dynamist, sure, it's just another name. Um, Majesty seems to be the most cracked one, because um, um, it adds one from deck if you've got, like, the Magic Spectre or another Draco Slayer in the other scale. Um, and then... Does it add a Magic Spectre? Hmm? Does it add a Magic Spectre? Well, it's uh, not adding Kieran. No. But that's where I'm going a, with this. Add a Draco <laughs> Slayer... Get Kieran add a one. Draco Slayer Pendulum Monster with a different name. Right. Wait, Kieran's at one of the OCs. And then he can destroy a card in your Pendulum Zone. Sure. And then, yeah, when it's summoned um, by Pendulum or Special, it searches any field card. Fair. Just any. All right, you ready for this, Jake? So you ready? one in the OCG. Um, these aren't going to see any meta decks. You know, the meta decks that you would take to your locals and play in tournaments to get OTS packs. Speaking of OTS packs... <laughs> ben really wants to talk about this, even though Ben's just going to fucking bitch No, I'm with him. No, no, no. You, you, you don't understand, Jake. If you're with these ulties, you are in the bin currently. So, I don't know if we announced all of these on our last podcast. We did But not. we have the full set of the new OTS oh, 19. I haven't seen any supers, though. I just have avoided it for some reason. So, it's okay. Sort of... It's okay. It's okay. Remember how we got Kawaga Hercules? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we have the fusion material now. <laughs> you do. Both of them. Both of them. Um, yeah, so, um, as our three ulties, uh-huh. we have Fawn of Albaz, which we knew... Uh, water Enchanters of the Temple in Ulti and the Skill Drain. All uh, dog shit. <laughs> okay. The Skill Drain's good. Ulti- no, no, here's the problem with the You're Skill Drain. You're promoting degeneracy. Y- yeah, but no, okay, bigger that's problem. That's happening also, regardless. No, also, no, no, no. people that play Skill Drain don't give a fuck about the Skill Drain's rarity as long as it yeah. still says no. So here's the thing about the, the Skill Drain as well it's not going to look good because there's nothing in the background. Ra- there's no. Like place in that card to make he's, it look. He's cool. now going to pull up those dog shit German artworks and be like, "See, it looks good." No, no, no. I'm willing if they look good, they look good. But I know the cards are. I can't see how they made it look good. No, no, no. I'm, I'm that that looks, fucking that skill drain, you monkey. That does look bad. You're that a monkey. Horrible. Also, I said th- skill drain. There's three photos here, you fuck. So I just show clicked me skill on the drain. first Why one. Why are you showing me? Yeah, see, there's no room in that to look good. It literally exactly what I said. Thank you, Jake. I appreciate you. Anyway, I'd much rather just turbo pack. So, what would you have as ulties? Seeing okay. as though you've shot down okay. the last we nine only get, of them. So we only get three. We assume one has to be high priced, medium priced, and low priced. Why does it have to be that? Because that's what the OTS has always been. Except not the last one. Oh, actually, the last one is... You're actually right. The last one is... Yeah. Of, yeah, they were all kind of here. Oh, here. Like, Zeus was very clearly the cheaper one, but... Yeah, and like fusion was very clearly like so, yeah. um, but not as wide of a gap. All right, what are you doing? What are you picking? Ash Watson. Fucking great idea. Yes. My shit one can be tornado dragon. <laughs> okay, it's short cheap. I thought we established there has to be a shit hey, one. No, no. Did, yeah, yeah. And no, I'm with you. Third, and I'm hundred percent with you. I'm hundred percent with you. I'll deal with you. No, 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 no. Your third. Ben, totally fine. Not my unicorn. Yeah. All right. So you can't have a link that's a high price. Yeah, it has to be a medium price link. Yep, not medium. Price. So for the same reason that you shat on uh, the ecclesias and stuff, uh, unicorn has a collector's rare. But that's I a lower that rare. For that reason. That's a lower rare. I shouldn't that because they're locked to an archetype, and they're just unnecessary. Yeah. The regular print is already uh, as expensive, is expensive as fuck. All right. Now to the oh. major one, Ash Blossom. Yeah, brilliant. I don't think people realise that Ash Blossom as an ulti is a terrible idea. No, it's fine. It would look great. Yes. It would be very high value. Yes. The problem with it is, because it's high value, because it would look good, because it'll be chase, it'll be fucking expensive. Yeah, cool. So you you have to... From your OTS bag, you have the decision of whether or not you sell it and make a lot of money, or you go for the three. Which is the problem that we had with impermanence with I don't think that's a problem, full, uh, no, fucking, a problem I think it is why 
This is only a problem for people who want to... It won't, because it doesn't increase the price of the lower ones, which is the only thing people care about. As long as it doesn't increase the price of the secret, the super, the fucking $18 commons, as long as it doesn't bump them up. I don't care how expensive imperm is. I don't care how expensive droplets is. I care that I can pull one and then get the three I need, because I can just go, here's a fucking ulti, give me the three secrets. I don't reckon it's a good idea. So you could just do also as an Ogre, ulti? Uh, yes, Ogre Talents is an ulti already. Uh, Ogre was a fucking expensive. Ogre is a fucking expensive ulti. Was it already an OTS ulti? Um, I was thinking draw ultis. Ooh, yes, draw gross. ultis. Um, there was one I was thinking. Oh, a dragoon. Give. Eh, Give dragoon. With Verte Ban, there's literally no point. That's yeah. That's what I want as the like rando one. Is like the all right. We haven't printed enough. I think it would be cool. People different. would jerk off because it's a fucking yeah. black, uh, not blue eyes card. Fuck me. Well, it's not a blue eyes card. Magician. Yeah, it's literally the only one of that three that it isn't. <laughs> so it's a red eyes card. It's a dark magician card. It's not a fucking blue eyes card. Um, but your talents would be cool. Talents would look really nice too. Talents has collectors. What card? Has a starlight. I mean, starlight. That's the one. Okay. Every good card has a starlight. Every bad card it it would look better than a starlight. Sorry, sorry. They could make it look better than a Starline. I'm not going to say, yeah, you listen. Uh, but there are a lot of choices that aren't skill drain fucking. Uh, uh, a skill drain, a card that is in an archetype that nobody fucking plays anymore. So, Fallen of Albaz. Skill drain is a great ultimate rare. Yes. Back when we got Turbo Pack 8, skill drain is an ultra rare. Yes. <laughs> it's just, like, Imperm was sick. Droplets was sick. That 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 section of OTS. Yeah, a good OTS where it was yeah. decent. It had C- there CDI was one in it there as well. Where it was fucking abysmal. Yeah, but that run where it was like imperm droplets, fucking CDI. CDI yeah, that was, was astronomically high. It was so a great... hard to get any of it. Yeah, Jay, you pulled it off. Nobody it was great. fucking wants to. Only Except people... they fucking do. No, they don't. They they want. Do you know what people actually want? People actually just want to make money for playing the game. That's yes. what they actually want. This is they your actually prize wanna, money. Yeah, they want to pull a three hundred dollar card so they can get some recursion so no on the deck. They so bought. if no one wants it, how are they making money? It's not about no one it. wants it. The, the people who will buy it off you, the really high end collectors or really high end players, let them pay the three hundred dollars because they will, and we know they will. And that's okay. Let them do it. I don't mind them doing it. I think it's stupid, but they don't, and that's totally fine. And that's why these ultis are shit. Anyway. What's going to be the most expensive one? Water Enchantress, probably. I don't know if it will be. I don't think people will want I don't think they will either. Do you know why? Because it's a fucking archetype. Nobody plays anymore. This was a good ulti two so, ulti Esters ago. Yeah, they he, fucking he's killed another, the archetype. Here's a just... follow-up problem to my problem that you raised that was a problem of mine, not really a huge problem of mine, but since now that I've had 10 seconds to think about it, actually is an increasing problem of mine. You print ulti goddess, a water enchantress. Yeah. It has the collector's rare. Sure. The people who play high rarity have already spent a bunch of money on. Yeah. The who people who play that consider as a high rarity to ultimate rare. Do they? Eh, Is it? Yeah. On top of that, mm. those people now aren't going to buy the ultra the ultimate rares. So there's gonna it's gonna be one of those like mid tier Hundred forty dollar royalties that, you're that not no gonna one really wants it. to buy. Yeah, you're so gonna have gonna to sell for one hundred twenty, one hundred and ten. Yeah. You're gonna have to take yeah. an offer. Someone's gonna lowball you. Yeah. Also, by the way, if you got the option of being given a collectors or a a, a, a ulti um, forbidden droplets, would you take the collectors? Starlight. No, no, no. collectors or ulti. Oh. If you got, uh, like, I don't know what a collector's forbidden droplets look like because it doesn't exist. Yeah, no, I... but what, what I'm saying is, if you're given the option, I think I'm always taking the ulti. I'm always taking the ulti because I don't like collectors risk. But... Yeah, that's, it's it's strange to consider that the... there, there would be a case to say that collectors are higher. It's rarity. very dependent on the card. Some yeah. collectors, granted, look fucking dog shit. Some oh, of them yeah. look like, desires. Very I, nice. Desires, I would always take an ulti. Always. Yeah, it's an interesting Any argument. Any pot it card, I would take very much on the card. Oh, prosperity. Give us ulti prosperity. Sure, it'll be three hundred dollars. I get it. I think they do. I get it. Just I think you give do us extra something. extra first. Oh, that'd be nice. Yeah, you do extra first. Then once the value of prosperity comes down, then oh, do duality it. again. But what about pot of inquisitiveness? No duality again. What about positive, positive, <laughs> positive reinforcement? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> I was too busy trying to think of pot of generosity. Pot of generosity. Uh, <laughs> just pot like of avarice. Pot of <laughs> Um, anyway. anyway, beyond those three cards, there are some other ones. Um, oh, so the what, supers what... are even worse. Oh, are they really? What are the supers? Uh, we've got Caius, the Shadow Monarch, Great. Uh, Trap Eater, which I'm happy about. That's the best super. By <laughs> yeah, the way. it is. Uh, Pain Painter, which is likely counts itself as Plague Spreader. Um, DD Burfamet, Performer Pal, Odd Eyes Dissolver, which is like a fusion thing. Uh, Triple D Flame King Genghis, uh, Triple D Oracle King Dark. Uh, for being Chalice as a him. super, which isn't too bad. Oh, that's that's respectable. That's pretty cool. That yeah. should have been an ulti. Even though it already had an ulti, give it another one. <laughs> that's the, the duality. Give it another one. Uh, oh, and, okay. and decent comments. Like Ben said, the material for the fusion card he hoped was never printed. Uh, Swamp Battle Guard, Lava Battle Guard, Sw- Night oh, Assailant. The- hold on, hold oh, yeah, on. Did they, you say Swamp Battle yeah, Guard? They literally, the commons are just like, what if we just printed anime shit? That's cool. Yeah, it kind of is. Uh, I'll take or- it. Look. Gores, yeah, they, they just <laughs> reprinted attack a order. Common gores. Attack order. Uh, Low like, fire blossom, heroic challenger, thousand blades, wisdom eye magician, performer pats. Uh, could Rat. we get? Could we get like a talent or a storm or something in these? Could we get any, like you know when as pa- a common? No, as a do you know when punish? <laughs> do you, Imagine. Do you know when punish me got reprinted? Like, that was a great super. Yeah, oh, but like, that's completely different to what I, you're implying. But what I'm saying is that like it, these slots could be used for like kind of nice reprints so that the, are already like twenty bucks. In my opinion, the super, talents is like like so twenty five thirty. Bucks. This is probably where Konami is coming from at the moment. Is that there is that many product delays that they simply don't know when these OTS packs are coming. Mm. And then, so by putting these obscure ones in there, it's not time specific. Yeah, Whereas if sure. they put in like a nice reprint for a deck that's all like meta now, Apparently, and yeah. then by the time the they actually arrive, like, that deck's been slaughtered on their most recent list. For example, I think this happened like three OCS packs ago, where the supers were entirely archetype specific current meta stuff, mm. and it got delayed like three months. And by the time we got it, everything was gone. That was right. Like, I mean, we know we're not getting a list till fucking December. Do you remember the spiral ones? Yep. Yeah. We got oh, all the spiral man. stuff oh reprinted. God. All the spiral reprints yeah, were just did. after it yeah. died. We got the OTS pack in like May, and it was like, oh, cool. But wait, we... no, we never actually got that OTS pack in Australia properly, because that was the COVID OTS pack. Yeah, yeah. So when we came back from COVID, that was the OTS pack we like, got. And hey guys, like, super agent. Uh, mm, this yeah, because I remember uh, this getting it and then being like, cool, and then I got back and I went. Hmm. Why are we forgetting this? Um, but also, we know we're not getting a list until December. So yes. It could do it. Didn't we're we getting it? the ban list on my birthday. D- Christmas. So there's two different lists. Yeah, we go off websites. the one that gives you a date. What club? Because I'm fairly sure it's the US site that gives you the date. What? So there's two different ones. Sure. One we're... says yeah. no sooner than something or other. December. Which puts it a lot... No, no. No, one doesn't have a date. One has a few months. Yeah, one says uh, a few the months. Others a few the months. Other Christmas. Yeah, yeah. Um... So we're all kidding Christmas to do a podcast here. Yeah. I'm incredibly busy that day, but sure. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, we could do it. Who would have known the Jewish kids would be busy on Christmas? I mean, yeah. You Wait, know. you just don't believe in Christmas. What the fuck? It's my birthday. Yeah. <laughs> you don't get to have two things. Fuck you. He doesn't. <laughs> he's not. That's the point. Um, I think. But that's anyway, um, bad ulties. Um, unfortunate because no money. Hey, yes, Craig. Can we smell burnt toast? Yeah, there's a fire at the toast factory. Oh, again? <laughs> hey guys, it's Jake here from Cowboy for Game. Thank you so much for watching. If you've liked what you've seen today, check out the description below. You'll find a link to subscribe to our channel where you'll find a heap more content. More content? More content. So much more content. Like what? So much more podcasts, deck lists, um, and highlight clips like you've seen today. Subscribe. <laughs>